Ah, uh, finally. Graduated from Hogwarts, defeated Lord Voldemort, and married Ginny. But, it just feels that there's something missing. I've mastered magic, learned spells for levitation, time travel, and transfiguration. But, there must be something more. Ah, I've heard of this magic, mystical magic school. The spells and the magic there are completely safe. I don't have to fight Voldemort anymore. Ah, it is based in the West. It's called SPMS. Scientifically Proven Magic School. Mm. Teleport! Based on my mathematical calculations, you must be the great Harry Potter from Hogwarts. Yeah, yeah it's, yes, I, 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 The anomalies in my molecular modeling tells me that you want to learn some scientifically proven magic? Yes, 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 yes. Huh. I sense a disturbance in the force, and it's telling me that with the right guidance, you will be a great wizard of SPMS. We, we want, want you! you. <laughs> wow, so many choices! All right, all right, Harry. Enough of talking. Let me show you why you should join the Physics School of Magic. Understanding of physics principles allow you to manipulate reality, distort the perception of muggles, and with the right understanding, you can even summon fantastic beasts Descend. Since the dawn of time, men and women have dreamed of flight. With the understanding of physics, not only we are able to conquer this dream, right now I show you how you can defy gravity. Come! Let me show you again. Come! Ah, but you see, I too know a spell for levitation. Wingardium Leviosa! Wingardium Leviosa! Ha! Huh. See? Your magic relies on concentration, willpower, and sorcery. My magic, on the other hand, works every time, regardless whether you believe it or not. Let me show you how levitation works without any sorcery. Hold on this handle. The power of physics. Wow. Amazing. Aha, uh -huh, sure. The manipulation of physical objects might be very cool for the common folk, 
But what if I tell you that you can manipulate decisions and control the outcome of every game, every time? Surely that is more useful and practical than physics magic. But wait, don't we all have free will? Sure, free will. We will let the muggles from the psychology department figure that out. In fact, even before a decision is made, I would already know the end result of it. Right inside here, I have a prediction. And now, let us play a game. I will need someone to help me up. Hmm. How about you? <laughs> you have a very nice smile, but I think you won't be smiling anymore if you know what we are about to do next. What is your name? Kester? Oh, that's a nice name. How do you spell it? Okay, thank you very much, Kester. Uh, are you Singaporean or? Singaporean. Singaporean. Uh, which uh, program did you just join? Sorry? Physics, chemistry, mathematics? Oh, chemistry. chemistry, okay. <laughs> Let's give Kester a big applause. This is a game of life and death. And I hope you're feeling thirsty right now. I have some cups with water here. This cup is, however, empty because I'm going to fill it up with this. Sorry. Okay, um, now we're going to take turns and we're going to choose either one, two, or three cups and drink those cups. Okay, so there is a cup of chili sauce here, all the best. And if you make me drink that cup of chili, you will also get a nice pack of chocolates. Okay, so please go first. So choose one, two, or three cups and drink those cups. Any, yeah. Uh, Team, right? so. Okay, so one, two, or three cups. One. All right. Say cheers to your friends and bottoms up. No, I'm kidding, kidding, kidding. Because you have proven to be so brave, I will still award you with this. Yeah, let's give Caster a big round of applause. All right. Um, and now I'm going to, to play another game with all of you. So on this screen, 
you are going to see um, a deck of cards. And I need every one of you to think of a card from the first row. Okay? And then you will start counting according to the rules. So if it is a number card, you count that number. If it is ace, you count one. And if it is jack, queen, or king, you count five. Okay, so let me show it on, on an example. So suppose that you are thinking of the uh, queen of spades, right? So then queen is five, so you count five cards. One, two, three, four, five. So then you get the eight of hearts, so it is eight. So you count eight cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, right? And then uh, you arrive at uh, three of diamonds, so you count three. One, two, three, and so on and so forth until you get to the last row. Okay, so I will skip all everything in the middle. So. Uh, for the sake of the example, suppose that you get the three of hearts in the last row. Then you get, you count uh, three. One, two, three. It's a kin. And you are supposed to count five, but there is no more room for that. Okay? Which means that since there is no more room, you cannot count five. It means that the king of diamonds is your final card. The card that you uh, uh, arrived at if you started from the uh, queen of spades. Okay, so now, that was just a, um, an explanation, and now we are going to play for real. So let us shuffle the deck of cards. So shuffling, shuffling. All right, so now I need every one of you to think of a card from the first row. And then I will um, predict the final card that you arrive at when you start counting. So please don't tell anyone because I will able to overhear it. All right? So start counting. You will have 45 seconds. Most important are the colored solutions. That's the most important. The biggest can be. Okay, everyone's done? Have you got your answer? Okay, good. All right, now please remember the answer. Remember what you've got. And now I'm going to reveal my prediction. Okay, so my first prediction is that I would win the drinking game. And I would win it against Kester and the card that you got is the Ten of Spades. In fact, I was so sure that it would be the Ten of Spades that I even chose to wear it on my shirt. Very cute indeed, this manipulation of choices. Mm. But Harry, let me tell you this, true magic 
lies in the manipulation of materials and the mastery of the elements. Elephants? Elements. You see, like modern alchemy, where you change sand into silicon chip and ashes into diamonds. But wait, then why aren't you rich? Why aren't I rich? You see, Harry, these powers of us, you cannot suka suka anyhow use one. Oh. You see, you can only use it for good and only in times of need. Such as now, I can see that you are now very thirsty. How about a flask of water? Hmm, I prefer something a bit more flavoured. Flavoured, you say? No problem. How about some... Wine. Oh. Shiraz, vintage 2010. Oh. But actually, I'm feeling a bit hungry now. Hungry? No problem. That can change too. Wine? Into? Milk. Almost fresh from the cow. I say, uh, <laughs> I actually lactose intolerant. Oh, lactose intolerant. Oh, I'm so sorry. I guess I can't really satisfy your hunger. But perhaps I can satisfy in you your other senses. How about some colorful chemical magic now? Music, please. Wow, that was amazing. Such mystical mayhem. Such amazing feats. Oh, I can't wait to harness such magic. Oh no, no, Harry. These acts are not derived from magic. These are just laws of nature, available to you if you desire to seek them. The secrets of the universe open to you if you open your mind. Right at your fingertips. Wow, I can't wait to start learning. Hmm. I wonder what I can achieve. My hopes, dreams. Ah, maybe I'll become a professor. Oh, maybe, maybe I'll discover something new. The marvels of the universe are just out there for me to discover. I can't wait to start my new semester at SPMS. <laughs> Introducing Leonard Chan as Harry Potter. Dr. Jojo as the Physics Wizard. 
Dr. Feather as the Mathematics Wizard. <laughs> Prof. Tan Hao Xiang as the Chemistry Wizard. <laughs> the backstage crew, Jermaine, Wilden, Sarah, Wei Liang and Ian. AV and lighting crew, Priscilla, Faris and Joel. Dragon Airboat, Dr. Ho Shen Yong, Zheng Jue, Jun Hong, Yi Cho and Winston. A production by Meta Illusions, Alexander, Yu Ji, Joel, Elijah, Anderson and Kim. Behind the scenes, production crew, Grace and Mika, Prudence and Helen. Production of the drum, ramp and gyroscope, Abdul Rahman. Chemical testing and preparation, Ai Hua, Zhao Xuan and Nuit. And special thanks to Prof Chi, Prof Chi Yaoming, the chair of SPMS, Prof Chu Lok Yu and Dr. Alexandra Bonani. Thank you very much.